Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope you've been vibing with the scribes like old times. And I hope you're having a great and wonderful day. Today we're going to be doing some collage on book page to make some journaling line cards and some tags. And so um, I've already got this one that I've done the back with some uh, scraps of tea dye paper. And like I said, it's just some book page. It's actually from the Southern Living 1987 annual recipe book that I've tore the pages out of. And um, you just need two pages, two book pages. See here, can I get the whole thing in screen? Maybe if I go this way with it. Okay, I think that's on screen. And your Yoohoo stick or whatever glue stick you like. This is the one that Gail Agat Augustinelli uses. And so this is the one that I've been using. And if you're going to be sewing them, you don't need to put much glue down to glue these two pages together. If you're not going to be sewing them, put a lot of glue down. <laughs> Completely glue them down. Oops. Okay, I must have not cut these evenly whenever I trimmed them because they are not lining up at all. Okay, so I'm going to be using um, some of Poppiness Woodland Wonder. And um, what else? I'm not sure. We'll see as we go. So I need some... That's going to be off screen. My gluing will be off screen. Um, this is from Poppiness Woodland Wonder. This I think she had intended to be like some journaling cards. Um, but I'm just going to use them for collage. And I have no idea what I'm really doing. I'm just going with it right now. Um, can I put this up here maybe? Not even once again. Oops. Okay. Is that piece? I think these bears are kind of cute. I want to use that. Um, keeping in mind that I'm going to be cutting it. Where's my ruler? Once upon a time I owned a ruler. Uh oh. Started the video and I don't have any idea where my ruler is at. I guess I won't be using my ruler today. Because I don't know where I put it. Whoops. Okay, well. Um, hope for the best. Glue this guy down. It's moose, I think it was. And I'm sure the video is going to be very shaky because, like I said, my um, camera is connected to my table and it's just one of those, uh, what do you call it? Um, whenever I remember what it's called. Oh, like a dining. Uh, table, I forget. TV dining table, something like that. Okay, glue him up here. Um, I really need my ruler. What did I do with it? I may have to stop this video to find it. Excuse me for one moment. I completely lost my ruler. And the bad thing about it is it's clear. So it blends. Oh, okay. Uh, great. I found it. Whew. I was going to have to completely stop this video and start it over. To find my ruler. Okay, that's more green. I want some brown. Um, let's use some of this. Some tea dye paper. Or coffee dyed paper one of the two. Some of this. Okay. My ruler is a lifesaver in my opinion. Whoops, that did not tear as I wanted to wanted it to. Oh, not at all. Okay. And this is from um 
my Porsche Prince for Involved Attic, I believe. Okay, I don't want that much. Okay. Make sure I'm still on camera. So what are you guys up to today? Are you collaging with me? You got something else you're doing? Let me know in the comments. Mm. Oh, I do have these scraps that I could use that I was going to use on something else and then forgot. problem for me. Mm. Yeah, I'll just tear this down a bit. did not plan how I was going to be collaging, I just knew I wanted to collage, and so that is what I'm doing, and I thought I'd bring you guys along with me, okay, let's see what else we have, we got some bunnies, There's more brown in this kit, but I'm not finding more brown, so maybe it's wrong. Maybe we'll put this deer here, put the bunnies there. Oops, you got it stuck to the page. it doesn't have to be exactly even. It's just collage. It's supposed to be fun. I'm going to glue on this other page over here. Make some random book page. Okay. We have a cute little deer. From the Pedra 11 A4 Age Textured Layer Sepia Background Page with Roses. Okay, let's see if I can put that there. Smells like somebody's got a fireplace going today. I wonder if it's actually that cold outside. I haven't been outside to find out, so. Hmm. Taking some of this dark brown from my coffee dyed paper. Lay that down here. I'm working on camera. The space to be able to work is so small. Oops. Yep, that side. Are you guys doing a Woodland Animal Journal? I know a lot of people seem to be doing one at the moment, um, which is quite a 
fun so that we can see all the different um yeah, everybody's different work you know because it's always different even if they use the same supplies Use some book page, maybe. Actually, Bible page is what this is, not just book page. Maybe put that right in there. If you're looking at this thinking it doesn't go well, I know that I'm going to be cutting these down. So, I'm not too worried about it. And hopefully I'm doing it in a way that it'll cut down nicely and still look nice. Already 11 minutes in. Probably took too, far too much time trying to find my ruler. And what's next? What's next? Oh, yes, I have these uh, from Taylor Made Journals. Uh, her. Grungy wallpaper kit. Whoops. something small I need something small <laughs> maybe I could put that bear right there tear the bears in half maybe I think so I think that'll work There, yep. <laughs> it wasn't long enough. And then you need another piece. A smallish piece for that side and since that's gonna be cut down I think I'll use this again Okay, 
so the front of that's done now this is what the front looks like now to do the back side after I trim around the edges save that piece because it's big enough and the rest can go to the garbage okay so now to do the back which means I gotta find what I did with all the d-dyed pages I laid them somewhere I had them just a few minutes ago okay I think I found them okay We got some of this, some of this, got some of that, some book page, like brown wrapping paper, got some lined tea dyed paper, a bit of a digital. Start there. So we're running out of time here. Whoops, that did not cover very well at all. <laughs> okay, well maybe I'll use some of that to cover that. So, uh, if this video cuts, it's because my space on my phone is full, and I terribly apologize now. But I'm going to try to show you exactly what it is that I'm doing before that it happens. dropping and knocking off pieces that I wanted. <laughs> I found part of my issue where I couldn't find any small pieces. They're sitting over there in that corner. If you don't have any digitals, I highly recommend using like book page and receipts and tea dyed papers and stuff like that, collaging with that. I think it turns out pretty cool. It may not be everybody's taste, but I like it a lot. And it's a place to start, you know, so. If you're new to junk journaling.
I'd probably take much more time and much more thought on this if I wasn't filming. But since I'm filming, and I'm sure you guys don't want an extremely long video, or at least uh, if it is too long, I may not be able to upload it. So whether you want a long video or not, I don't know that that's something I have the ability to do right now. So I'm new to YouTube and all of its all of the hoops that you have to jump through to upload videos and make videos. <laughs> Whoops. Okay, yeah, I did do that correctly. So. And the reason why I'm doing nutrients on the back is just so that people can write on it. Neutrals for the most part, anyways. Okay. Let's see here. I could probably use this. Yep, that would work. It's light enough to be written on. I'll take some of that. Um, trying to find my bag of small scraps. all quite light. This stuff is darker. Don't really have time to just sit around and ponder what I want to do. I need to just get something accomplished. There's that piece. I'll stick that piece there. It looks like a fit. Slide that around. Oh, that piece is just laying there. Okay, well, uh, looks like it'll fit there, so. Welcome to your new home, piece of paper. This is part of the edge of that Bible page. don't really want an image on the back. Take some of this. Oops, I'm not doing a great job at tearing that. The trick to tearing paper is to make sure you're pressing down hard here on the ruler, but tearing lightly, pulling very gently with your uh, hand that you're tearing the paper with, pulling up the paper. That is the trick. I did not make that big enough really, but Put that itty bitty scrap on the edge. Okay, so I think that's pretty well complete. Close my glue stick. 
find my scissors. Try to trim up this edge. cutter which is on the floor I'd highly recommend waiting till this dries but I want to show you what it is that I'm doing so I want it to make sense not just be oh she claws on some paper That's neat. you know what she gonna do with it next Got that piece didn't get cut properly. Okay. Um, so this is about uh, seven and three fourths by almost eleven. It's about ten and three fourths. So thinking about cutting it down at four inches. Each, so let's try that. And with my paper cutter, I kind of do it like this. Bring my ruler all the way to the edge of my paper. Hopefully you can see what I'm doing. I'm gonna line up that four inch mark with the cutting space. And I'll pull my ruler out. I'll just cut along that spot. And then pretty much do the same thing again. So that's about four inches there. So I'm going to have two journaling cards and a tag. That's what I'm going to be left with. So that'll be one of the journaling cards. And I'll probably trim it down just a bit around the edges. get it all even. Hopefully I'm on camera. Okay, so that should be pretty well even there. I gotta stand up to see if you can even see what I'm doing. So there's that one. That'll be a journaling card. And that's what the back of it will look like. So then same thing, I'm just going to trim around the edges of this one. Make sure everything's quite even. this edge that doesn't look even. It's quite wonky there. <laughs> okay, but I don't want to take too much of that bear off. There. So I really like how that one turned out as well. And journaling card there. Here's the back to journal on. And then same thing, I'm going to trim around the edge of this one and turn it into well, I was thinking about a tag at first. Now I'm kind of changing my mind. Take my scissors to this one a bit. It's probably not the 
brightest idea. I don't get straight. Trim at the bottom. Okay, so I could turn this into a tag, but I really don't think that I want to. Just think I want it to be a skinny journaling card, maybe. Then again, I may want to turn it into a pocket, put a little thumb hole there. And have it a side pocket, maybe? Or it could be a belly band. It could be a belly band. Let's see. Some measurements of it. Yeah, maybe a little bit short for a belly band. I could add some lace or something to the top and bottom, turn it into belly band. But anyways, um, thanks for collaging with me, guys. And um, I hope you will join me in my next video for some more fun. See you guys next time. Bye, guys.